This forecast is powered by Comfort Now, comprehensive heating and cooling solutions for Atlantic and Cape May County. Hey, good afternoon, South Jersey. Welcome to your drive time forecast. I'm Nor'easter Nick. Look, another really gorgeous day out there. I don't really think anybody's complaining. We had temperatures in the lower 70s today. Mind you, we should be at about 76 or 77. Instead, we're at 73 in Mays Landing, 74 up in Woodland Township, as well as Tom's River, 72 in Cherry Hill. And on top of that, our dew points remain crazy low, and that is why we got down so low for temperatures overnight. Actually, 42 was the lowest I could find just west of Mays Landing this morning. We are going to start to warm up as our winds begin to shift out of the south. So tomorrow morning, as you guys wake up, it is not going to be anywhere near as chilly. Current satellite and radar shows you zip. Nada, nilch, nothing going on. We have to zoom out and you'll see that the closest area of precipitation several hundred miles up to our north over central New York. And then this system kind of discombobulated right now, but that's going to eye up our region by tomorrow afternoon. And that is what is going to increase our shower and thunderstorm chance. Uncomfy, uncomfortable, that's what I'm trying to say. Air moves in by tomorrow afternoon as a result of that wind shifting out of the southwest. Our dew points are going to come back into the lower 60s. And yes, it is going to be kind of soupy, and that is going to spark some afternoon showers and thunderstorms. It looks like the severe weather threat is down to our southwest, but something we have to keep in the back of our minds as we plan your day out tomorrow. And then we're going to clear out for your Thursday. Things are certainly going to get much better. We'll break out into partly sunny skies. We're going to be hot but we'll start to be a little bit more comfortable as the cold front eventually comes all the way through. Your temperature trend over the next uh, four or five days here, 87 on Thursday, but then we're in the lower 80s. That average should say 76. I don't know why it's down to 68. I guess I haven't used this graphic in a while, but regardless, you see that we're trending in a pretty decent direction with temperatures not too far above where they should be this time of the year. 59 tonight, mainly clear starry skies. Like we said, it is gonna be much warmer. We're not looking at dropping down into the 40s. I know a lot of you were concerned about your plants. Don't worry, it didn't get that cold last night, but still a little bit nippy. 85 for your hump day Wednesday, partly cloudy, and the window of opportunity for storms pretty much all afternoon. That's not to say it's gonna rain all afternoon, but the chance of these thunderstorms moving through will be there from say about three o'clock until about 10 o'clock and then another round could come through overnight. Again, the chance is there. That doesn't mean it's gonna be an all day washout. 86 on your Thursday, a passing shower thunderstorm possible in the morning through the afternoon. We're looking at partly cloudy skies and improving conditions overall. Your seven day forecast. I think we set things up for a decent weekend. Saturday's nicer than Sunday. Sunday we have a small chance of a couple passing showers, but generally I like the look of the seven day then going into next week, pretty much status quo. Have yourselves a great afternoon.